Coming up next, it's a UFC heavyweight showdown. excited for this one. This is a kickboxer of the highest order. He has so many different kicks and punches in his arsenal and figures to try to keep this on the feet here tonight. The beautiful thing that he does is throws that front push kick to create distance when a guy starts to get too close and wants to wrestle with him. He throws it, and the moment you're back at his range, he starts to blast high kick. He doesn't always intend on landing it, but he beats up your arms with high kick after high kick after high kick. And then as you get desperate, you start to run into knees, and he does not need much space to land a knockout punch. This guy is one of the best strikers we've ever seen in the UFC. And if you don't find the striking range early against this guy, you could be in real trouble. Well, this is exciting here, DC. The founder of Jeet Kune Do, one of the founding fathers, really, of mixed martial arts, Bruce Lee, is back in a big spot here tonight. Bruce Lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate. Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said, I want to be a fighter. It was the speed. It was the charisma. It was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special. And tonight, he's going to look to show a new generation of fighters exactly how it's supposed to be done. And if you hear the phrase, drillers make killers, right? I mean, that was Bruce Lee in a nutshell. He felt like practice yes, would make yes. perfect. Nobody trained as hard as the great Bruce Lee. And now our tail of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Two years apart, these two fighters, with some differences in height, but the same reach. And now for the particulars, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon is Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet ten inches tall, weighing in at 165 pounds. Fighting out of Mumbai, India, Big Train. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, USA, Bruce the Dragon Lee. You've been giving your instruction in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it official. They touch him up, and we are underway. Ready. Ready to fight. All right, so here we go with the start of round one. I can tell how excited you are for this matchup. Seems to be a striking advantage on one side, but maybe not. It's a big time fight. It feels like a big moment for both of these guys' careers. Who is going to be able to implement their game plan the best in this matchup between these two big time athletes? And just misses with that big right hand. All right, he'll engage in a single collar tie. And they separate. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You gotta like what you're seeing thus far. I mean, the speed at which he throws is crazy. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. And they are exchanging leather early. How good is this action about a minute in? I think I'm gassing out just watching this thing. I'm exhausted trying to call all the strikes that these two men are throwing at each other. What a fun fight. Yeah, I hate to be the punch counter. <laughs> 
pinpoint accuracy on that kick. No wind up, no tell, just a brutal kick. I mean, he's cutting down the size. Beautiful leg kick. Punch coming, it's blocked. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Oh, a little single collar tie there. Oh, the master of the transition. Nice scramble. Telegraph that spinning back fist. Big call punch lands. Now we get back to range. He's able to slip the left there. Lee gets tagged with a kick now. Let's see if he can wrap. Let your hands go. Let those hands go. Just out of the range with that right hand. Just kick to the outside of that lead leg. You gotta start checking these, these man. Got to check these kicks, or you're gonna be limping around the octagon very short. Check yourself before you wreck yourself. Oh, big punch land. He loaded up there on that high kick. Under two minutes to go in a back and forth first round here. Yeah, he's fixed it all up. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those legs. Ooh! Alright, he closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. Come on, buddy. Keep your hands up. Let's go. Cable right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Lee's hook shot gets blocked. The defense saw that one coming. Big body kick lands. Lands with the kick there. No pad on that foot. No shit guard. He's taking all of that kick every time he throws it. Great punch. That is as big a strike as he has landed thus far tonight. Big, massive shot lands. Look at how tough his opponent is, though. Still standing, still in their fight. Bleeding from his cheek now. <laughs> 30 seconds now to go in the round. You gotta get this kick down. Ooh, head kick lands, he's hurt. 15 seconds. Take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. Oh, that straight punch is gonna be a real problem if they can't make the adjustment. A real problem. He needs to move his head defensively if he's gonna avoid getting hit so many times to the face. All right, so an entertaining five minutes. Let's look back at some of the highlights, DC, and I'd imagine a lot of these replays are gonna be rooted in that kicking game that was on full display. Absolutely. You're gonna see a lot of different techniques, but the kicking was the key to him getting ahead in this fight. He's out ahead now. He needs to stay the course and continue to do that as the fight goes on. But you're forcing those leg kicks too much. Let's not do that. You have to let it come naturally, just like we've trained. Ready to fight? Ready. Good. Oh, nice check on the leg kick offering there. Wow, what a head kick. Oh, big left. Wow, what a kick. Huge kick lands. Can't take many of those. You better check. Oh, good kicks. Timely defense there. Huge block for him. All right, he engages in the single collar tie. 
big punch lands in the middle. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Very nice leg kick there by Lee. And that left hook landed on the button. He got him whip his hip into that kick. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? And they separate. Nice straight punch. Head kick. And he landed the right hand there. How good is that right hand? What a tricky hit. Relax, relax. Just over three minutes to go now. Straight punch lands. Well, he has really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive than we saw in round one. And now starting to find himself in the pocket. Kick to the body by Lee. Man, look at that damage on the right side of his body. Starting to really bruise now. Changes his stance. You'll see a lot of this from this fighter. What a punch. Got the single collar tie. Loaded up on that right hand, too. Look at that. on the feet. His opponent in a lot of trouble now. That was Cain Velasquez's punch of choice. Every time he lands that right hand, right? He hurt people bad. And this guy has his opponent hurt very badly again. Single collar tie now. They continue to exchange. Lee's got the tie clinch. Let's see what he can do with it. Connection with a punch there. It's hard to recall time to pass that his boxing look this sharp. He's never looked this good. Punch is broke. Keep your hands up for me. Come on now. Let's move. Let's make it go. Stay focused. Look at how he turned his hip into that leg kick. Way to be first. Oh, bone on bone, shin slash foot. Right to the skull. You see why I'm a commentator and not a fighter, you see why? Yeah, those aren't fun. I'm telling you, man, you get kicked in the head. A lot of times, it's the end of the night. Got a little experience with that. Yes, I do. A little bit. Horrible. Nice job of hiding that head kick. Oh, good kicks. And going back to the jab just out of range. Oh, he has landed a high volume of strikes in this round and really hasn't let up when it comes to his aggressiveness. The striking has been on point every step of the way. Careful to not gas out, but you gotta like the output here down the stretch. And he's looking for that left hand, just missed. 15 seconds remain in the round. Big shot land. Beautiful leg kick throw. As he gets close, he watch a hot ball. Nice pop there from the crowd as he finally gets the takedown. He stayed committed to the offensive wrestling, and now he has his opponent. A sigh of relief from the people watching because they were tired of watching him flail around trying to get takedowns and get defended over and over again. Finally gets it. Now what does he do with the top control? All right, there's the end of the round, so it was a huge strike to the head that stunned his opponent and, and nearly got him out of there. Yeah, that was a big moment. A big strike lands, his opponent's on wobbly legs. That is exactly what, what you want to see as you're walking back to your stool. Your opponent staggering back to his corner and being hopeful that he can get it back together before the start of the next round. He blocked 
the punch. Well, not only has he stayed aggressive as he was in the previous round, landing a high volume of strikes, but he's also been efficient, not just with his strikes, but also with his body movement. Complete performance out of this fighter here tonight. And they separate. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Oh, looked like that left hand found the target. Found the target as it has on so many occasions tonight. Nice punch land. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Big knee to the body. Oh, nice counter to land the left hook there. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are gonna take their toll as this fight goes on. Oh man, that cut not in a good place, and it's not getting any better. Looked like he might have landed there. Instead, a swing and a miss by Lee. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block. Look at the angle of that nice body kick. Right. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Switching stances here. Just misses there with the left. Now connects with the right. Powerful leg kick land. That right hand hurt him a little bit. Well, this is exactly the sense of urgency you're looking for. Try to take the judges out of it. He is lighting them up now. Lee gets hit with a kick here. That one landed flush. Let's see if he can make some adjustments. Hands higher, hands higher. Big body kick. Looking to land the right just out of range. we're seeing from him, especially in this round. Right punches there. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. And he switches to South. This is with that punch. Nice leg kick land. Oh, and he tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Lee. Final seconds of round three. It's very tricky to throw that body kick. And that'll do it. 15 minutes in the books. 
All right, that's the end of the round, and you see the cut on the cheek. That thing is getting downright nasty. It is getting worse here by the minute. And you gotta wonder, to what extent does that impact him moving forward here in this fight? You at least have to ask the question. All right, let's take a look back at some of the highlights from those previous five minutes, DC, and uh, no padding, no glove on that foot. No glove, no padding. And look at the hip action when he throws those kicks. He's not only kicking just for feel, he's really trying to damage his opponent. And as the fight goes longer, you will start to see it taking effect. Well, just as he did the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. Nice. Leg kick. Nice slip and counter there by Lee. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Ooh, blocks the shot. Oh, man, this is one thing you, you do not want to get kicked in the head at MMA. You cannot take too many of those head kicks, but this guy gets his leg up there so fast, sometimes you don't see it come. Head kick. Nice punch lands over the top. Timing his shots pretty well here early, DC. He's doing a great job of mixing things up, keeping busy, being very active. Strong defense here as the hook to the head is blocked. You don't know when that leg kick's coming. Oh, and he tags it with the straight, beautifully placed there by Lee. Beautiful body to land right under the elbow. And they set. All right, so he's landed some good shots. You hate to be overly critical, but nothing really in terms of combination. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Nice strike. Oh, man, how is he standing? Brutal knee to the body. Stuffs the takedown without issue. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. Watch these to the body. Some nice back and forth action here. Oh! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Yet again, all oh, but not a good look for the judges here. Look how wobbly he is. Leg kick. Good punch, Lance. He lands the head kick. Man, his counters are on point tonight. The jab is good. He's, he's limping now. Trying to hammer that lead leg. And they separate. Big punch land. It's such a fast leg kick. Well, that left hand has been there at times, not on that attempt. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Big kick land. How about that shin? And there comes the separation now. Ooh, looking to go to the leg kick here, just out of range. Quick leg kick. Checks the leg kick. Oh, collar tie. Oh! DC 
see it didn't take him long to find his range here tonight, huh? His timing is on point. I mean, look at the commitment to kicking in this fight. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. There's no tell on that leg kick. Oh, nice connection there with a the punch, DC. Great timing to land that punch. Tags him with a flush left. Horn sounds for the end of round four. All right, that's the end of the round. And our cameraman all over that cut on the cheek. That thing is getting wider by the minute and only getting worse. Cut man going to earn his money tonight. All right, so a big round for him there, maybe even a 10-8. There was a big knockdown in there, courtesy of the kick. DC, talk us through it. He found his spot. I mean, he knew that there was a weakness. He found the spot. He recognized an opportunity to go and chase down that head kick. He threw it, it landed, and he almost got the pin. Let's relax. Excellent work. All those rounds on the pants in the gym have paid off. You ready to fight? Yeah. 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 Fifth and final round. Caught that kick there. Lands the lead right punch. Still unable to find that precise range with the high kick. Oh, an obvious limp there. His leg hurting for certain. Well, the left hook has been there at times, not that time. Oh, there as he lands, and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Oh, man. I think you jumped out of your seat a little bit after that. Oh, I did because I have time where I've been kicked like that. And I'm going to tell you one thing. It does not feel good. You can't take too many of those big elbows. Oh, and there's the double leg takedown, DC. That is just too good, too easy. Too good, too easy. The timing was just too good. Before he could even defend, he's already off his feet going backwards. It's hard to run backwards. And that's what happens when this guy hits the double leg. Oh, man. This ground and pound is good. Probably my favorite striking realm in MMA, and he's as good as it gets. The problem is the opponent is not controlling his posture. He's allowing his opponent to get up, and when he does, he creates this space to land these beautiful ground and combinations. Just over three minutes now to go in the fight. Oh, single collar tie here. Ooh, what a punch. That was a thudding leg kick. Oh, man. Oh, the kickboxing chops on full display with that offering. Nicely done. Beautiful kick landed by this man. Big leg kick land. Nice head kick. Trying to establish that jab once again. Nice punch here. All right, so oh! the now. He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, he might be out. <laughs> Two minutes out of going to fight. Position for him here. He's got the full mount. See if he can get that ground pound. Oh, he's got to get it going, but he can't rush. A lot of times, guys get in the full mount and they rush. They get nervous. They're like, "Oh my goodness, I'm winning." The reality is, you're winning, but it can change in a matter of seconds because then they can be gone. He's got to drop his hips, be really heavy at the opponent's base, and then just start to work. Make the opponent give his back so they can try to get his chokes off or find great ground and pound, but very patient ground and pound from such a dominant position. 
while he's staying pretty effective here, fighting off of his back. Nice strike landed there by the bottom by Lee. Working out of the half guard here. And look at the redness starting to appear on the left side of his body. His opponent would be wise to continue to attack there. All right, 45 seconds now to go in the round. Oh, this is where you don't want to be, though. Well, he's up, but he is hurting for certain. The finish could come at any time. Nice head kick. All right, he engages in a single call. Oh. He's out! He got him! Yeah, that right there is a high-level knockout, ladies and gentlemen. Crowd absolutely loving it. Just a perfect shot to end the fight, landed flush. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming. So a huge, huge win for that young fighter here tonight. Well, another highlight for the real DC as we look back at that scintillating knockout. Yeah, but the whole fight was landing great strikes, kicks, punches. He was doing everything right until eventually he found the shot that ended the fight. Now we go inside the octagon, Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Stop this contest at four minutes, 32 seconds of round number five. Declaring the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon Lee. Well, he's smiling ear to ear, and why not after a knockout like that? I need to take it to the after party tonight. I mean, this is what dreams are made of. You dream of the knockout like this, and then the party after, where you and all your coaches get to celebrate the great handiwork. Oh, couple, left me out to dry, had to